So what you'll see coming up is, look, a group of young men, or two young men, foolish enough to drive their car. So we've got to laugh into the marshes. So what's going to happen now to them is that they've got to push that to the edge or no one's going to be able to take them home. Sorry, I shouldn't be. <clears throat> Do you know what? I must say, seeing driving past, right, and seeing two boys um, trying to pull out their 1.1 1 1 .1 souped up black car out of the marshes, literally had me laughing because it's like this is why I always say you have to respect nature you know you can't just think you know certain monuments you can get to by car you know certain monuments are sacred you did in the long haul you've got to walk to these places if you think you're gonna <laughs> sorry if you think you're taking shortcuts especially with your car you're going to find your car under fucking water, mate. <laughs> you know, so they ain't going to get out. That's why I didn't stop. Because my thing is, I ain't driving my car into no marshes. My name ain't Sheep. So, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> sorry, that's just really tickled me. And, um, you know, they weren't even waving people down. Not that people could come anyway. Because it's going to need a man to push that shit out. But um, why aren't they calling AA? <laughs> Why aren't they calling 101 and why aren't they calling RAC? Because at the end of the day, they ain't pushing that shit out because the more they were pushing, the more I could see that car was getting deeper and deeper and deeper. Because what they obviously don't realise being there in their early 20s is marshes are like quicksand. This is why they need to bring back this survival shit in school. Because I'm telling you now, anyone over 25 ain't going <laughs> to be winning no Armageddon. Because... You know, when you're trying to cut corners and drive into fields with your car when it's just been raining, that's literally no common sense. That's not stupid. That's just no common sense. So, I don't know if they were brought up in Wales, because most people brought up in Wales, and they kind of know, you know, wise man say, no drive car in field. But um, especially after it's been raining for a few days, <laughs> clearly even those boys ain't from Wales. <laughs> well, they wanted an adventure for the day. <laughs> so anyway, as you can see, being out into that, <laughs> I'm not drunk, by the way. I'm not stoned, but. <laughs> Being out today has literally got me laughing because that's the most funniest thing I've seen in a long while. Especially when I was up on the stone circles praying for answers. And literally, as I'm coming out of this um, King Arthur stone, I'm seeing a car stuck in the marshes quite far in the field. I'm thinking that's my answer. The answer is, don't be fucking stupid. So whoever that message is for, it's like, don't be stupid. Oh, <laughs> then, because it looks like you're going to need a fucking amber, <laughs> not ambulance, fibre grade to get you out of that one. You're going to need a tow truck with a long tow. 